First, let's 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 talk about what are your main takeaways from the results of the primary? My main takeaway is just that there is strong support among Republicans for replacing Senator Lee and sending more unifying and effective leadership to Washington. And I think that's important. Most Utahns want to make a change here. We know that we need leaders in Washington who will stand up for our interests, who will hold the, to, to common or to, to principles, but still find common ground. Uh, right now, the politics of division and extremism have broken our country, and it doesn't need to be this way. And I think America needs Utah's leadership and that's what this campaign is about. It's about uniting Republicans, Democrats, and independents uh, to replace Mike Lee and, uh, and send leadership to Washington that will better uh, serve Utah's interests and help the country move forward. Yeah, you seem to be running on a country um, over party idea. And nowhere is that more evident than Utah's Democratic Party uh, choosing not to endorse their own candidate, but to throw their support behind you. Look, I think there's a, an important moment uh, here in the country, but especially here in Utah, where people are just fed up with politics as usual. I mean, they're just broken. I mean, we, we've got all these challenges, inflation, especially you know when we go and fill up our cars every week or multiple times per week, depending on how much driving you do. It's just a, a kick in the gut every single time. Healthcare costs remain high. We've got air problems and water challenges. I mean, we need leaders who will who will set aside the broken politics of division and extremism and be willing to stand up to special interest groups and party bosses and just put the people first, put people first, in this case, put Utahns first, put the state uh, uh, and our commitment to it first and not these outsiders, not outside special interest groups, not party bosses, not extremist groups on one end of the political spectrum or the other but put Utah first. That's what that's what our state needs, but I also think it's what the country needs of us. I sincerely believe that Utah has a moment to help the country move forward, help unify the country, help it overcome its major challenges. And, uh, and we have the opportunity, frankly, if, if we prevail in this race, I think it'll make Utah the most influential state in the union. Together, uh, serving with Senator Romney, I, I think we'll have tremendous influence on the direction of the country, and I want that for our state. Evan, what Evan, do you think will be key in setting you apart from Mike Lee? What do voters need to understand? What will be the big difference? The, big difference. the, the biggest thing is that, uh, two things, I would say, first and foremost, I just have a different style uh, of leadership, and, and we'll bring that uh, to the U.S. Senate. And what I mean by that is that, you know, I'm interested in getting things done. You know, I, I disagree with you know, a, a lot of senators in the Senate about a lot of different things. Um, but if I disagree with somebody on 90% of the things, but we agree on 10% of things, I'll work with them on those issues. And so I'll work across party lines to just get things done. I mean, with inflation the way it is and our drought and so many other issues, this partisanship, this extreme partisan partisanship that plagues the country just doesn't serve our state well. And, and Mike Lee has certainly bought into that. He embodies that. And, and that's, that's the biggest difference. I, I think we've got to have leaders who will find common ground to solve problems. And I'll reject, the other thing is, I'll, I'll stand up to the parties, party bosses on both sides. You know, I'm not going to Washington if, if we prevail to, to, to be a, a lackey for Joe Biden or Donald Trump. I want to put the people of our great state first. You know, we have a, a, an incredible history that I think has a lot to offer the country, especially in this moment, an incredible, a better way uh, to do governance. And, and that's what I want to bring to Washington. That's what this campaign is about, not the politics of division and extremism that Senator Lee has unfortunately uh, bought into so much and further during his 10 year or 12 year tenure. Well, Evan McMullen, I appreciate you taking the time with us and letting voters get the opportunity to know you a little better. Thank you. Thank you so much.